but I hope you guys will stay safe and well with all of your families. going to make a roasted garlic I actually bought a ready-made roasted garlic uh, this is fried garlic ready-made and I'm going to compare which one's better of course the fresh one's better I also make roasted garlic every month and I put it in a big um, container and I use it for everything I use it for saute I use it for garnishing I have it ready You can throw that away because I have tons of that kind of container. I'm just chopping the ones that were not really minced that much, so they are all going to be evenly minced once we put it in the pan for roasting. All right, we got everything minced right now. You can also use the electric mixer, or you can also use the multi-function electric uh, grinder. I'm using extra virgin olive oil. You can also use avocado oil. It is also good for roasted garlic. It is now done. In 30 seconds, we are going to turn it off. I have been smelling it for the last, what, 30 minutes? And it smells so good. I used to be not a big fan of roasted garlic, but ever since I roasted garlic for the last few months, I've been really a big fan. So right now we're going to turn this off and then just put it on frying. <laughs> we are now going to 
going to make the roasted peanuts. Mixing it until it is done. Kosher salt. We'll mix it with eye dice. Roasted garlic. We're done. We have the roasted garlic here and we're just pulling it off and then we'll put it in the container. Usually this two here will last us for a month for garnishing and using it for garlic bread. It takes a lot of time to make it, but um, you can also buy it in a container. This is available at any Asian store. You will be surprised that the, uh, the fresh ones is more expensive. This cost me probably 12 to $13, but this one only cost me $7.65. So this is cheaper. That's it for now. And I hope you guys stay well and safe with the family. God bless everyone. Bye. My director is not.